you and Brittany are putting up a lot of blocks right now. How uh, just how does that feel to be um, doing that and how much impact do you think that's having on teams that you guys are blocking as much as you are down there? Um, yeah, we really just try to get our hands up. If we can't block it, at least alter the shot. Uh, we're playing, we've been playing against a lot of great forwards and posts. Um, so we always know they're going to the ball a lot. So we're just making sure we're in the right positions um, to get a handle on it when the, when the shot goes up. When you go back to Texas, does it, is, is it significant for you at all? Um, I know it's not the Houston area, but I mean, just when you go to Texas in general. Yeah, it's always nice playing in your home state. I have some family coming up for the game. So I think it's always exciting when family can make it to your games. And are, are you figuring that uh, Sky's going to be pretty pumped up playing back in Dallas? Um, yeah, definitely for sure. Um, obviously, I don't know what it's like to play a former team, but I'm sure Sky's excited for the opportunity. Next up, we have Alex Simon with the next. Hi, Brianna. Obviously, when you face Dallas, you get to take on Enrique every time. Kind of when you face her, obviously, I'm sure it's an interesting feeling just from the college years. But what are you seeing her do as a player that is continuing to evolve her game at year three at this point? Um, I think she's really great at her one on one game, um, really shifty with her moves. Um, so, yeah, I think she's really just expanded her offensive um, side of her game and can really create whatever shot she wants. When you face a team like Dallas that obviously is as young, do you guys kind of go into the game kind of with the mindset of, hey, we know Enrique is going to get her shots. We kind of want to do what we can to stop her, but we know she's going to take them or kind of how do you kind of game plan when there's one dominant scorer, but kind of everybody else is around her? Well, we know along with Enrique, Moraine has been playing really well these past few games. So we know we can't just focus on one person because they obviously have other threats as well. Uh, we know it's going to take um, team defense and making sure we're helping each other out and not making it seem like it's one on versus Enrique. It's, it's going to be one versus five because we're going to have help side of people behind whoever's guarding the ball. All right, our final question comes from Ron Thulin with the Dallas Wings broadcast. Thanks for spending some time with us today. Uh, off the court, favorite memory of Enrique? Um, I mean, was she, I mean yeah, one, thing, one thing that uh, Mabry says, she was always late. I mean, she, she couldn't be on time for anything. Uh, do you have a good um, memory? A memory I remember is her freshman year in college, and we had one of our first like summer workouts. And like she brought her phone to the weight room. We were like, what are you doing? Like, hide it so we don't get in trouble. So. Being late, bringing her phone, typical Enrique. So <laughs> sounds about right. And one final question. What is the biggest thing, the biggest jump you've made since you entered the league? What is the one thing you're really proud of that you've accomplished? Um, I would probably say defensively. Um, just getting out there and guarding whoever, whether it's a guard, a big, a post, just being confident in my ability to guard and stay in front of whoever I'm guarding. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you.